What's up, boys and girls? Just giving you a little pre-run uh, information. Today's day five, Friday, uh, March the 31st, 2018. Um, it's about 10.30 in the morning, so off work today. I'm going to go for a morning run. My legs feel pretty good. They were tight this morning when I woke up, but I've stretched and walked around a bit, so they feel okay right now, especially given that I've ran uh, 33 miles in the last four days. I don't know how far I'm gonna go this morning, but I, I honestly might today really just do like three miles in the morning and then maybe do three later, or three and a half and three and a half because uh, I just found out, or I guess I remembered that tomorrow morning I'm running a 5K um, on the road. So normally that's not that big of a deal. I mean, it's just a little 5K, but you know, I've, I've got quite a bit of miles on my legs for me at this time so my initial goal was going to be to i guess just kind of break 30 minutes um which is not you know fast by any stretch of the imagination but given that by that time i'll probably have 40 miles on, on my legs in the last five days i think that'll be a a decent goal because my calves and my achilles have been pretty tight and my it bands have been pretty tight when i'm finishing up my, when i'm finishing up my runs so I have to make sure that I stretch really well and keep, you know, foam rolling, taking ice baths, doing the things I need to do so that I'll be able to perform um, the next day. So that's where I'm at right now. I'm going out for another neighborhood run just for time's sake. Again, I'd much rather be on the trails, but um, I don't know. I'm feeling pretty good on the sidewalks the last few days, especially uh, compared to how I felt in the past. So. Uh, we'll see what happens, but I'll see you out there. This has been great so far, and Operation Life Improvement all the way. Let's get better. There's no time to stay the same. Staying the same is going downhill, ultimately. So Operation Life Improvement, you, me, together. Let's do this. <laughs> nice. Nice day out today. Not too hot this morning at all. Not cold. I don't know. I'm just trying to give you an update. I don't really pay attention to the weather. I create my own weather in here. It's always 70 and sunny. <laughs> so just go out regardless of the elements and get the best of it. Always 70 and sunny. Always time to get after it. Come along and join me. Operation Life Improvement. Getting better every day. All right, so I'm almost two miles in. Legs warming up a little bit. They really feel good compared to how I thought they would feel. Now I'm approaching, or I guess I've hit my 35th mile for the week. It's the furthest I've ever ran in a week. I still have two days left, so really inspired by that. Feel really good about it, man. Ain't no time to sit around and listen to my legs because they'll tell me to stay inside and take the day off. What's well, the challenge? Just gotta keep going after it. Keep getting better every day. Come along with me on this journey. I know you want to if you're not already. So lace up your shoes, whatever shoes you have. They're running shoes. Just start running in them. You'll feel so much better. Let's go, Operation Life Improvement. Let's do it. sit down for a second and take a little rest uh, right over two and a half miles into my run I'm at the front of my neighborhood so another two and a half miles back that'll put me in five miles this morning 
and I'll probably try to do a couple more this evening. Uh, my wife doesn't know I'm doing this, so maybe I'll run a couple miles this evening and she'll just think that I just ran a couple miles today because if she knows I ran this morning, she probably won't want me to run again tonight being that we're doing a 5K tomorrow. If she knew I had already ran over 35 miles this week, she definitely wouldn't want me to run anymore. Um, I mean, she knows I'm crazy. She, it's not gonna surprise her that I've decided to try to run 50 miles in a week um, overall. But when she first hears about it, it'll surprise her. She's the one that got me into running um, a little over a year ago. So I, I would no, by no means call myself a runner. I mean, the most miles I've ever ran in a week is 34 until this week. So um, that'll, it'll surprise her, but it's a positive thing. Should be all right. You know, it's not like I ate 35 cupcakes this week. I ran 35 miles, so I feel good. I feel great, actually. And uh, I'm inspired by all the people I see on, uh, you know, doing their own videos that run or, or on social media that run. And, you know, the, the people who are not, who have ran their whole life, you know, people that have run their whole life and, and definitely people that have not ran their whole life that have either recovered from an addiction um, to drugs or alcohol or a food addiction, which is, you know, uh, an, an incredible amount of people, and, and especially in the United States, everybody's addicted to food, it seems like. So, you know, I just feel good out here. You know, try not to, I don't know, be that, be that guy in his mid-30s coming home from work, sitting on the couch and complaining about stuff. So I'm very inspired, and I'm inspired by you all holding me accountable to doing this. So let's do this together. Check out this view, this is pretty cool. It's a great place to just sit, relax, take in a nice, nice breathe, <laughs> take in a nice breath, good fresh air. This is great. This is, I'm so glad I'm doing this. All right, let's get back at it. I'll catch you back on the road. A couple more miles to go. Let's get better. Feeling good, still almost four miles in. I don't know how much further I'm gonna go this morning. I might probably just hit five and then chill for the day. I gotta go get my race packing for my 5K tomorrow. So that's exciting, I need to stretch really well. Walk this out a little bit and uh, maybe get a couple more miles in this evening. You gotta remember, no one really cares if you don't go run, if you don't push yourself to get better. If you don't care, your friends, your family, you know, they're gonna love you anyway, or they should, but you gotta do this for yourself, so I gotta make sure I get back at it. No one's forcing me to do this, it's just me. So get after it. Get better today, not tomorrow. Start today. Let's do it together. It's a great day to be active, to get better, and to improve your life. Okay, I just finished up my run for the day. Uh, Friday, my fifth one of the week. I went a little over six and a half miles. So I don't know when I'm gonna do this two a day thing, but I don't think it's gonna be today. Once I start running, it's, it's just so easy to keep going and knock it out, but uh, I feel good. I feel really good. I feel accomplished because I was gonna go three miles and then I said I'd go four when I was running and then I was gonna go right at five and stop. But I took another turn to get some more in and I ended up going six and a half and I feel great. I feel like, you know, pushing myself is, is really, good of course and I feel accomplished so I've stopped here at this little playground
I think I'm gonna have some fun on these monkey bars, climb on up there on top, sit up there for a little bit and relax. But first I'll show you what I did as far as my mileage goes. All right, so we're day five in the books. Look at my stats, so to speak. Went uh, 6.62 miles, 946 pace. Took me an hour and four minutes and 41 seconds. I ran on the road or the sidewalks once again. I ran in the morning from 10.30 to about 11.35 a.m. And that brings my five day total to 39.81 miles. I'm, uh, I'm proud of you know what I've been able to do, but I'm certainly not finished. It feels really good to be where I'm at. I'm looking forward to these last two days, these blank spaces, fill them up, and reach my goal of 50 miles. So let's do this together. Operation Life Improvement. Started out with a blank piece of paper. I'm filling it up. Let's get better. Operation Life Improvement.